what is up and welcome back to the Radiant Rangs. I'm Kosser Ali and today I'm back here for a new day, a new video and a very new topic. Today I have another maths video to show you guys. And for previous videos, I'm very glad and I hope that all of you really appreciated, appreciated it because it got many views. And as you know that my exam is coming up soon, so I decided to get a lot of math tricks to make it more easier for me. And today I'll be showing you another math trick. But before we get into this video, make sure you subscribe right now. And when you subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you get a notification when our videos are posted out on YouTube. Please like our videos and also share these videos with many others. So let's get into this. So for today's math trick, it is going to be another fun multiplication trick. And by the end of this video, I'm pretty sure that you guys will honestly love this trick. And you will instead use, use this way instead of the traditional way. Today we are doing multiplication with the numbers by 15. Yes. You guys will be shocked once we finish this video, and by the end, it will be so fun. And I hope you will love maths as much as I do. So now, let's get into the equations. Wait, wait. But before we do the equations, I have a few steps to tell you. So, when we do the equations, it will make it much more easier. So, the first step is to add a zero by the number we are timesing by 15. And when I, when I say this step, I'll explain it in much more detail when we get into doing the equations. Once we finish the first step, the second step is to half the number that we added the 0 to. And once we do that, the last step is very easy. We just add both of those numbers and boom, we get our answer. Of the number we times by 15. So now let's get into our first equation. I'll go from easy numbers to bigger numbers. So let's start off with a two digit number. Let's take 15 times, hmm, let's take 79. Yeah, 15 times 79. The first step is to add a zero, but we have to add a zero to the number that we are multiplying by 15, which is 79. So basically what we are going to do is make it 790. So basically turning the two digit number into a three digit number. Then we have to half that number. We have to half 790. And when we do it, what is the answer? It is 395, right? Yes. So now we have 790 and 395. As you can see in the last step, you have to add the number 750 and the number that we divided that by 2, which is 395. And when we add that, we get a total of 1185 and yes boom we got our answer isn't it so easy guys like there are hardly even any steps to do this and there we go See, it's so easy right you can do this in easily in about a minute so we finished our first equation and now let's move a little bit harder onto a three digit number times by 15. So let's now try a bigger number. Isn't this starting to get a little bit more exciting? And if you guys are following along with this video, 
make sure to have a pen and paper so you can also write down these steps to remember these equations and how to solve them. So let's do 15 times a three digit number. Let's take 345. Yeah, 345. Then we can follow the same step like we did with the last one. And I just wanted to mention that any number that you times by 15, it doesn't have to be even because uh, even if it's odd, you have to add the zero at the end of it, which is an even number. So the odd number will turn into an even number. The even, even number will remain an even number. So now when we add a zero to 345, we got we get three thousand four hundred and fifty. So making the three digit number into a four digit number. Now we have to half the number. So three thousand four hundred and fifty divided by two is one thousand seven hundred and twenty five, right? Yes. So yes, 1725, 1725. Now the last step, like we did with the previous one, just add 3450, the number that we first got when we added the zero, and 1725, the number that we halved. And when we add that, we get a total of, dun, 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 5,175 and boom that is the answer see guys isn't it also easy even though the numbers get harder and harder it's also starting to get more and more exciting when you go to higher numbers you can give that a big tick so now let's move on to a four digit number to make it even more challenging for us. So now let's try a four digit number. Did you guys ever imagine that even though the numbers get higher when we're multiplying them by 15, that would be so easy? It's even more simpler than the traditional way that I assume that most of you guys would do. So let's do 15 times, hmm, maybe 9829. 9829. That's a good number. So the first step is to add a zero. So now make the four digit number into a five digit number. So that becomes. 98,290 and the second step is to half the number so 98,290 divided by 2 is 49,145 ding 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 and now the final step is to add 9,890 plus 49,145 and then we get our answer. And when we do add those numbers, we get... Dun, dun, dun. You get a total of... 147,435. Yoohoo! We did it! Even with a big number, we still got the answer. And now that we did that, we can give ourselves a big tick. Swoosh. And also, if you guys are wondering that how I added both of the numbers 98290 and 49145, we got a total of 147435. Well, here's how I did it. So first we add the units, which is 0 and 5. 0 plus 5 is 5. Then we do 9 plus 4, which is in the tens column. 9 plus 4 is 13. So we write the 3 and carry forward the 1 next to the 2. Then we add the hundreds. So 2 
plus the little one and the other one. So 1 plus 1 is 2, and 2 plus 2 is 4. Then we do 9 plus 8 for the thousands. 9 plus 8 is 17, and we carry the 1 into the 10 thousands place. 9 plus 1 to make the friends of 10 is 10, and 10 plus 4 is 14. And that's how I got 147435, and it is correct. Can you guys believe it? We progressed from two digit numbers to four digit numbers. And I want to do a last one with a five digit number. I'm doing this just so that you guys can also be confident that even with high numbers, this trick still works. So 15 times, hmm, let's take 71,496, a good five digit number. Okay, so for the first step, add zero. When we add a zero, the number becomes 714,960. So we, it became a six digit now. Then we have to half that number. When we half that number, we get 357,480. So we finish those steps, and for the last step, all we have to do is add 714,960 plus 357,480. And when we add that, let's go through the addition to make it more easier when we add them. So first off, we have zeros So for the units columns, we have 0 plus 0, 0 plus 0 is 0, as nothing and nothing is nothing. And then we have 6 plus 8 for the tens column, 6 plus 8 is 14, so you can write the 4 and carry forward the 1 into the next column. 9 plus 1 is the, are the friends of 10, plus 4 is 14. Then we carry forward the 1. 7 plus 4 is 11. Plus 1 is 12. So we write the 2 and then carry forward the 1. 1 plus 1 is 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. And then 2 plus 5 is 7. Then for the last bit, all we have to do is add 7 and 3. Those are the friends of 10, which means the answer is 10. And then we get a large number of 1,072,440. And boom, that is our answer. Woohoo! See guys, even with such big numbers, the trick still works. And I probably wouldn't need to use, I wouldn't, I would not most likely try to use a calculator for this. Because when I did the three steps, we immediately got the answer in under a minute. It is that simple. And if you guys felt like some steps were unclear to you, make sure to go back through the video and see the steps and get your answers right. Okay, my awesome friends, thank you all so much for watching this video. And next time when you do multiplication with numbers in 15, this should strike in your mind. And you can use this strategy anytime and it'll make math super duper easy. Also, don't forget to follow us on Instagram too, where we post short videos of what we do on our daily basis. Please do subscribe to our channel. And when you subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you get a notification when our videos are posted out on YouTube. Please like this video and share this video as well. See you all in the next one. Bye!